Okay, I zeroed out the uh, engine um, on this engine stand so that, uh, you know, it's, it's level. It's level. This is a digital protractor. And let's see, uh, we got the, the engine level. So that means that the ports should be identical. The flange angle getting 40.1 on this one I'm getting 40 on that one so I know I know that all the machining is pretty much dead on 40 Two tents. Of course, me. Uh, this this engine stand is probably wobbling. Forty. I guess in round numbers, I'm missing a guess. Forty. I'm gonna calculate this plate how it has to be bit, and. Then I'll be able to set that plate down on it and see if I got all the spacing correct for this bottom plenum that uh, fits here. And uh, most of you probably know, but what I'm making is uh, I purchased this one from a famous racing engine builder. I'm making this. I'm making this plenum that's in this inside here. You know, these are the ports that are welded, tack welded on, and this is the part that I'm making. Is this this can that goes underneath here and this this is all welded you can see there how they welded everything together this is probably about an eight year old manifold but maybe more than that ten eight, eight to ten I think I bought this so that's what we're doing that's what I'm making as soon as I get a little farther along um, we'll get back on it in the next segment see ya